Don't you want to try my delicious ice cream? I'm going to kill some kids today. I'm looking for the chump clubby ones. I'm going to find me some chubby kids and we're gonna make some ice cream fun. <laughs> <laughs> Don't play with me! Give me the ice cream! Hi, Jay! Are you coming to play? The boys are in the secret lair. My brother has told me he has something to tell me. Well, it sure is silly. Well, you know what? I'm going to kill some kids today. I'm looking for the chump clubby ones. I'm going to find me some chubby kids and we're gonna make some ice cream fun. <laughs> <laughs> yes, I, I recently tried some of my father's special ice cream, but it's only once. Why am I so different? I don't want to be like... Father, you were my only family. I never met my mother, but that never mattered to me. You and I were a great team, Father. I always wanted to be an ice cream maker as big as you. Though I wish you had more time for me as a child. I had so many problems in class, Father. Now I'm older, and I take good care of my affairs. Everyone has what they deserve over time. Isn't that right, Father? <laughs> oh, why are you crying, little boy? You know why. <laughs> yes, it's true. You and I are the same. That's right. The case is, I see you sitting there so small, so helpless. Sometimes I forget that I was like that. Yes, you, you have to remember the, the insults and the beatings and all those Dirty, a baby, baby, two by four. Hey, come through the kitchen door. Get out of my way, stupid lobby. Get 
Rodent. 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 No, now, now, be patient. Hmm? Dedicate yourself to to work hard and, and save as much money as you can and get out of that school from hell. It's doing you no good, boy. Do not come down. Eventually, you will get ahead. I promise. I asked my father for help. No, he will not listen to you. He hides many secrets that you will have to discover later. You'll see. You will become an ice cream maker as good as him. Mark my word, son. You will discover how to take revenge on them all. <laughs> oh, an unexpected help will come to you. A letter from your mother in which she will finally tell you something important. So pay attention, kid. You're going to be just fine. Out of here, please! <laughs> Hey, you! Yes, you tell me, sweet little boy. Yes, you. I know you have Liz, and I want you to release her. Liz? I think you're confused, boy. <laughs> no, I know it's you. I saw her in the trunk of your dirty van. If you don't release it, I'm going to fry your brain with this shotgun that I made myself. <laughs> Do you really think I know who you're talking about, huh? I don't remember the names of all the children I captured, you idiot! Stupid boy! You have the guts to face me, huh? But you're not fat enough to be useful to me. <gasps> Wait a second. There's an easy solution to that. Open up and say, ah! Perfect landing. <laughs> <laughs> Done. Wow. Oh, it's very tasty ice cream. I don't know why you did this, but I'm going to exterminate you. <laughs> What's happening to me? What is that? Hello, chubby boy. Now you're chump and clubby just like I like it. <laughs> I'm going to kill some kids today. I'm looking for the chump clubby one. Going to find me some chubby kids and we're gonna make some ice cream fun. <laughs>
Rod, do you live here? Rod, are you at home? You have to go back to her. You still don't understand, please. You have to come back. Oh, this has an explanation, Rod. Rod? Well, in that case, I'll leave this to you. It has been written by your own mother. I'm sure. Uh, is he healthy? I, I don't understand. How is this possible? Oh, my God. Oh, look at him. No, it can't be. Is this true? How could this be? This baby's born. I, I don't understand. Oh, so it's true. It is a miracle. A miracle. <laughs> Congratulations, Rod, for your 15th birthday. Be strong. We heard about the death of Joseph Sullivan. I wish I could be with you right now, but the Lord requires me here a little more. Congratulations, Rod, for your 16th birthday. Even though I can't come to you, you can visit me whenever you want. Don't resent me for not seeing you. If you knew why, I can't go see you. Congratulations, Rod, for your 17th birthday. Please... Come see me, I ask you. Congratulations, Rod, for your 18th birthday. Congratulations, Rod, for your 19th birthday. For your 20th birthday. 21st birthday. 22nd birthday. 23rd birthday. 24th birthday. Congratulations, Rod, for your 25th birthday. This will be the last time I write to you. It seems that nothing I say is enough for you to come back to me. Even so... I never stop dreaming of the day you and I meet again. We have so much to talk about. I want to hug you like when you were four years old and you were with me. Keep the book I give you as your most precious asset, for I will reveal a secret that only Joseph Sullivan knew. He stole it from me, but now I give it to you. Thanks to the fact that more time has passed, I have been able to improve the formula. You are my son, and you deserve it all. I will give you the opportunity to synthesize an extraordinary chemical compound with equal force to create a sparkling sun of life or a moon full of death. Warmly, your mother who will always be with you, Sister Madeline S.M.
Come here. I have a gift for you. That's right. Come a little closer. That's right. Where's your... I got you. They fall for the same trick every time. <laughs> It's over. Finally, the waiting time is over. I will finally return with my precious son. Look at them in their cage. I caught all the kids, the bad stupid kids. Now some ice cream will be made. <laughs> oh, I'm going to sleep and kiss you today. I'm going to scream and jump bloody it's well. you? We're going to sleep and kiss you today. We're going to make some ice cream fun. <laughs> well, well. Well, kids, you're all reunited again. <laughs> I'll leave you alone a moment so you can talk about your adventures. <laughs> but don't get too comfortable. No, no, no. Now that you're all beautiful and plump and chubby, soon you will enter my special room and I'll squeeze you to the last drop. <laughs>
Driving me crazy! How could they have run away again, huh? Well, these tubes don't take them very far. They're actually still inside my factory. <laughs> it's only a matter of time before I find them! <laughs> <laughs> Jay, are you okay? Oh, perfect, now leave it to me. And he's coming up, he's going right for the mouth. Oh, oh no, Mini Rod, you gotta open up and say ah. Father! Father! Look, I I've already eaten most of my food. Very good, son. This is how you'll become a big and strong man. Yes! Yes! A big, strong man like you, Father. <laughs> With a good job and, and, and many friends, I will be a famous ice cream man too, and a genius as great as my father. The recipe for happiness is within everyone's reach. Isn't that so, Father? <laughs> yes, son. It is like that. But that doesn't mean you don't have to work hard anyway. When am I going to be able to eat one of those ice cream? H have I worked enough already? No, Rod. You can never eat those special ice creams. You better get dressed quickly to go to school. I'll see you tomorrow, a little longer, maybe.
A burden for his green, caressed by silvery stream. Yeah. <sighs> what will we do in class today? Hmm. I want to learn about plants and animals. <laughs> the monks at my school have so many things to teach me. Why are older people so serious? Ugh. When I grow up. Will I be bald and fat too? Ooh, yuck. Will I be someone important? I hope so. Sometimes I, I try to remember who my mother was, but I can't remember anything. Oh. Mother, who are you? Where are you? Why can I remember? Why doesn't anybody know anything? <laughs> it's so confusing. Stop falling. Jay! Hey, Mike! Woo! Yeah. yeah! Let's rescue the others. Let's go. I've seen something suspicious. Near here, there's a lot of food waste. Hmm. Maybe there's kind of a giant kitchen around here. I can tell for all that amount of food that these pipes lead to a place where candy is cooked day and night non-stop. Liz is hidden in that place for sure. God, she's so sweet, she'll probably blend in with all that candy though. Charlie could also be there. Uh, mm -hmm. We need to reunite with everyone. It's the only way to give Rod what he deserves. We'd better stay focused, you hear me? Wait a minute, isn't that Charlie? Yeah, that's Charlie. Where are my friends? Why don't they come rescue me? Well, it seems like I will have to escape by myself. <sighs> At least this kitchen looks harmless. Maybe I could even eat some... <laughs> oh, God. I think, I think I need a plan. Charlie, calm down. Everything is under control.
You are buried under my feet. It was you who started the war. I don't regret what I did. And now who is knocking on the door? Good morning. I'm Sister Philippa, the abbess of this school's order. It's been a while since I got some news about this place. And as you may understand, I had no choice other than... From this moment on, you will be my slave! Ah, <sighs> well, it seems I have no more room in here. Maybe I can put just one more iron here. Mr. Madeline! Sister Madeline! <sighs> Philippa, I think the idea of doing laundry... Thank you. I don't deserve so many compliments. <laughs> Kill him! 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 Jay, I'm still here. I'll, I'll do what I can. Now we just need to find Liz. Okay, well in that case, I have something very important to do first. Fine, um, Jay and I are gonna start. Don't take too long. Anywhere. Wait a minute. When we escaped from Rod, do you remember which pipe she went down? Mm, I think it was the blue pipe here. What do you mean you think she went that way? Tell me for sure. Right now, Liz could be dead or worse. You're doing what we can, Mike. Calm down a little. I don't want to calm down. I'm sick of looking at the screen and not seeing anything. <laughs> no! Do that, it's dangerous. You're making too much noise. <laughs> wow! It looks like the pipes have opened up again. Oh. <sighs> Perfect. This is something else. Need that? <gasps> I'm gonna go rescue your sister. Jay, when I enter the pipe, 
keep pressing the button so that the lid stays closed. Please, uh. keep an eye on it to make sure nothing happens. All right, let's go. Better do something soon. <sighs> Liz, can, can you hear me? Are you okay? Mike, yes, I'm fine. Even though I've been hanging around here for a thousand years. Shall we go now? Liz, I finally found you. And Mike is with you. What a relief. Jay? Is that you? Shh. How nice to hear from you. We need a key card to escape. It seems that Rod has one stashed inside a safe box in his town's warehouse. Hmm. Let me think about it and see if I can come up with something. Hmm. What a coincidence. Looks like Rod is going to town. Uh... Ouch! What's wrong? Charlie, stop fooling around and follow Rod into town. I need you to get what he keeps in his safe in the parking lot. Okay, I'm coming. This is my lucky day. <laughs> Great. I'm getting each time closer to leaving this place. Get out of here, Mike. Listen, Liz. In case we don't get out of here, there's something I want you to know. Of course we're gonna escape from here. We'll talk right now, but first, let's go to the boys. <laughs> um, I, I don't want to say it in front of everyone. Uh... <laughs> I'm so glad you're both well. What are you doing here, huh? <laughs> oh, don't burn away, chubby kid! Come back here! I don't know how, but Rod found me and followed me here. Oh, chubby kids, get out of there now! Charlie, where were you? You should have come back as soon as you handed over the key card. It doesn't matter now. We have to stop Rod from getting in. By the way, how nice that we're all together at last. Oh, oh, chubby oh. kids! Get out of there oh. now! Oh! oh. <laughs> <laughs> mm. 
You're calling to the Spokane Police Department. How may I help you? Hello! My son, Jay Brown, has disappeared. We, we haven't seen him for more than a day. My husband and I have been looking for him, and we haven't found him. Worst of all, two of his best friends, the Owen children, have disappeared too. They were in the newspaper, and we don't know what to do. <laughs> We also have received all the calls about missing children in recent weeks. We're looking for the culprit right now, so please, stay calm. We're doing everything we can to solve this terrible problem. The more children disappeared in the last few weeks? What a horror! <laughs> Could you tell us anything that may help us find your son? Has anything strange happened in the past few days in your neighborhood? Now, now that you mention it, um... Lately, I've been hearing a strange ice cream man's melody. Mm, I see. Please tell me more about it. Where are you calling me from exactly? Oh, chubby kids! Get out of here now! Oh! Guys, what are we doing <laughs> holding the door? If we don't do something soon, the crazy ice cream man is going to break the door down Get any minute. Here. Liz! Mike! Charlie! I think I found a way out! Come this way, quick! Jay, where are you going? The ladies go first! <laughs> well, well, well! I finally have you all! <laughs> huh? No! Damn chubby kids! They escaped again! Oh! Oh, I can't take it anymore! This will be the last time they run away! Since I kidnapped them and locked them in my factory, they haven't stopped giving me problems! Oh! Oh, I no longer want to use them as, as, as ingredients in my, my special ice cream! This has become personal! Oh, I wasn't planning on resorting to this, but party's over! Bastards! <laughs> Take it anymore. If I run one more step, my legs will come off my body. Charlie, keep quiet. That sound we just heard? I think I know what it is. Roz activated the security system and all the exits are sealed. But fortunately, I found this lying around a while ago and it's given me a great idea. From the looks of it, there are three generators supplying power to the security system. And if we can disable them, we can escape this factory. Oh, and I have this as well. The, the person leading the exploration of each area will carry one and use it to call the rest when they find one of the generators. Ha! Huh, Mike, your habit of collecting junk and papers is amazing! Now let's go, team. Time to find those generators and go back with our families. Yeah! yeah let's, let's go! go. Is this my son's factory? It looks very magnificent from up close. At last, I'll be able to hug him and... Who's there? A fat, ugly creature like you can't be my baby! So I'll smash you with my hammer! <laughs> Charlie, get in position. Roger that. 
Come on. Alright, alright. This. Uh, uh. Let's go! Excellent driver. We have to do this again. <laughs> Ugly, broken robot. Your face looks like a rusty frying pan and makes you want to cry. You're too weak to be a security guard. Even a kid like me can beat you. Uh, um, Boris, do ugly. out of here together. Great! This is like a dream. Am I dreaming, Mike? Ah, stop talking all the nonsense! I need to concentrate if we want to get home in one piece. Mike, how brave you are. Please, don't bother him. Hey, since we finally managed to get out, can you tell me what you wanted to tell me before? Uh, well... I need to concentrate, Liz. Now's not a good time. Isn't this a good time? For a hug? Ooh, or for a kiss? But what are you talking about? <laughs> <laughs> this van is stopping right now, and y'all can walk home! I, I, I prefer to walk, Mike. No, wait a minute, Liz. Maybe you're just understanding things the way that they're not. I, look out for that tree, we'll hit it! <laughs> You guys okay? Uh, mm, it seems so. Well, we really have to walk. going on? <gasps> what? No! This 
This is impossible. They have managed to, 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 to deactivate the security system. Well, at least the rest of the chubby kids are, are still under control in, in, the, in the extraction room. Huh? Uh, the, 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 the door to the extraction room has opened. It must have occurred when the security system was deactivated. Oh. Well, maybe I should pay this place a visit and close that door before the room gets distempered and my chubby kid pantry is spoiled. I just found what seems to be the control system that is keeping a lot of kids inside pink fluid pods. We have to deactivate it. Liz, Mike, Charlie, pull the breakers! Now! Yes! I hope this time it goes well. Let's free those children and end this nightmare at its roots. Noise! <gasps> what? No! 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 Oh, those hateful kids again! Why do they always destroy my plans? Oh! They just need to stay still and let them let them be the ingredients of my fantastic ice cream. Damn fat kids! You're the same as my old stupid classmates. And my mother who abandoned me. <sighs> oh, I like, I like the air to breathe. <sighs> How come I can't catch my breath? What is my baby doing out there with the nuns? What? Those traitorous nuns are handing Elisa over to that itinerant ice cream man! And not content with that, they also give him part of my research as payment! As if my little poor Elisa wasn't enough! No! No! Wait a minute. This is crazy. An unforgivable sin! My baby is gone, and I can't leave school! I promised Baphomet! <laughs> I have to be a good mother! An exemplary human being! Pray day and night to him! Not leave this school until others! Thirty-six years have passed! It's impossible! No! You thieving nuns! What have you done? No! I'll kill you all! Baphomet? A crazy nun? I, I, I don't understand. Is it a memory? Oh, I just need to clear my head a little. I need to put things in order and, and eliminate those children. Oh, I have the ideal weapon for them. Guys, it's time to find that ice cream man and defeat him once and for all. This will be his final chapter. Let's go! Yes! Let's go. Yeah! Let's go! Rod, we finally have you surrounded. This time, 
We are gonna hunt you down. No, oh, stupid children! Have you not realized where you are? Huh? Oh, I am so sick of you! I'm going to break you into a thousand little pieces with this little freeze gun here! <laughs> <laughs> Filthy children, you won't make me think about my past again. Uh-uh. If I destroy you, everything that happens in my head will disappear forever. Like my frosty breath in winter. It will vanish. about tough times in the past. Kids at school were mean about my weight. None of them were still breathing. And my dad was my main family. Was guilty for my fatness because he had the secret recipe to make poison ice cream too. And he was too, he was too carefree with me. I don't understand. Did, did he move me from that convent because of that recipe? It's sad because he never really loved me. As a parent, he, he, he seemed more interested in being famous and rich. And my mom, the only one who actually cared about me, was a crazy nun who treated me like a girl. Is she still alive? Did she kill my dad for revenge? And if my real dad wasn't Joseph, was he that evil lord named Baphomet? That whatever I try to do, I can't undo the mistakes of the past. Life feels meaningless. My revenge. In my dreams, like ice cream on a summer night, are melting away. We both know quite well, worldly matters are handled with care. But, shall we embark, Brother Nazareth, and take on the dare? It's been a while since our talk began. Can't say your real name. You still hidden in the shape of a magical cup? What's your suggestion? What's your plan? Rod, a human creature you brought to life inside Sister Madeline is showing true repentance. Don't you think there's a chance? I can't do anything. That intellectual animal has me.
living beings just to stay alive. Help them vote. They'll survive. Then we share one objective. They succeed. We go to heaven. It's our Be that sure. See you soon, my dear. I can hug you again. I am very sorry for everything that happened. Please forgive me. I love you. You are my mother? Yes, it's me. Finally, I recognize you as my son. A grown man. I hope we get to know each other in the afterlife. to us. Uh, but Jay, what happened? You have also gained a lot of weight. Is that possible? My goodness. Ah, Chloe, stop. <laughs> <laughs> oh, man. <laughs> Quite the adventure. I'll tell you everything when we get home.